Kalle, congrats, a big win for you. Yeah. Um, really tough game. How would you describe uh, the, the match? I mean, with Felix, it's always really tough. We have known each other like, should I say, like 13 years. So we have been practicing a lot together. So everyone, we both know each other's game. And it's in the practice or in the matches, it's always been like three sets and uh, really close matches. So it was today, it was more about who is physically a little bit stronger. I felt like when I lost the first game, uh, I was a little bit annoyed that I knew that uh, he was doing much more work than me and then I still was able to screw it up and then uh, yeah I was it was fortunate that I was able to save the two two match points from uh, Felix and uh, then I knew like when we went to the third game that he looked more tired and, I, and uh, my coach was saying all the time that now it's a matter of physicality just keep working and uh, the easy points will come up and uh, yeah that was uh, that was the correct plan. Yeah, and he was right. <laughs> Let's talk about those uh, crucial situations at the end of the games. And the first one, you were leading like a long time in the ga uh, over during the game, and then in the end he took it. In the second game, he had two match points. Then you took it. What makes the difference in those situations? Ah, uh, it's just uh, like uh, me and Felix are both like really offensive players, so it's it's really like a roller coaster. Uh, like who is getting there? Like the attack so uh, I think we both were in the end uh, where we both had like uh, game points or match points we both were like ended up being like a little bit more passive and uh, hoping that the other one is making a mistake and that was my coach saying uh, in the third game in the end like just keep going and don't stop uh, attacking just keep going keep going keep going and uh, yeah here I am <laughs> Yeah, you had uh, some great runs also in the last tournaments that you played. Um, are obviously in a good form. Um, some more group matches coming up. What are your goals for this week? I mean, obviously, it's uh, my goal is to qualify for next year Paris. But at the same time, uh, my goal is to really climb up uh, in the uh, in the ladder in the ranking that I can uh, play in the bigger tournaments. And now, uh, past six months, I have been uh, finding the thing what I have been always lacking and that's consistency that I've been always like uh, in the matches or in my whole life like a roller coaster person so now uh, somehow uh, something has a little bit I'm, I have to knock on the wood or something that uh, now when I'm jinxing it all, but anyways like something has a little bit clicked that I have found uh, in the game a little bit more consistency and I think it's maybe it's that I'm more uh, physical on the court that I've been working a lot of on the physical side, so I don't get so tired anymore. So maybe that brings that, uh, but yeah, maybe everything. <laughs> yeah, everything has to come together in the end uh, yeah. to, to be successful. Um, yeah, some more group matches coming up for you. Uh, what do you expect from your upcoming opponents? Uh, yeah, I will say that uh, tomorrow I play against Emre Lale and uh, he can be good too. I mean, so I have to be ready for all matches and on Wednesday I play against uh, Andres. So uh, that guy is going to be a tough one, but uh, I always like to be the underdog and a little bit uh, unpredictable in that way. So um, I hope uh, that uh, I keep the level like what I'm having uh, now all the time.